Hi guys, Alex here from Drayton. So we've got an Audi A3, 1.5 TFSI COD35 Sport, finished in Mythos Black metallic paint. The wheels and tyres are all in good condition. These are 17 inch five arm design alloys. Car in general is in really good nick, both in and out. At the back, you do get a decent sized boot and those back seats will fall down if you need any extra space in there. You also have the storage netting in the back as well. This car has got MOT until January 2025 and will come with a full Audi service history. So, just moving inside. We have uh, the black leather sports seats, uh, nice and comfortable, good bolster on the side and the base to keep you in place. You've also got this pull out section for under thigh support if you need that as well. Uh, and then you've got full leather in the rear to match the front. Uh, up front you've got your ref counter on the left, speed on the right and your digital screen in the centre. Currently showing a digital speedo. Uh, but you've also got uh, your onboard computer, efficiency program um, on there as well. So you've got your fuel, fuel range, mileage, all that sort of stuff on there as well. Uh, moving across, you've also got your radio media, your Bluetooth and your nav on there too. On the main screen we have uh, Audi smartphones, so you've got Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. So you can have your own phone screen on the screen in the car that is connected via USB. Um, if you just want your calls and your music coming through then you can do that just via Bluetooth as well. Uh, you've got those options on there. And then you've got uh, the built-in sat-nav system but if you are using um, Apple CarPlay or Android Auto, then you can use Google Maps, Waze, Apple Maps, whatever your preferred preference is. But the built-in satellite system is nice and easy to use. Uh, you've also got DAB radio, all your sound settings on there. And then your car settings, you've got Audi Drive Select. So you've got various different drive modes, including an individual setting. So you can change the engine, gearbox and the steering to suit your own personal preference. Then we have the driver assist, which has got your speed warning, your parking aid, and your rain sensor on there as well. And then your servicing and checks, you can see when your next service is due. You will get a reminder close to the time, um, whether that be due to the mileage or the time constraint, but if you wanna keep an eye on it, then that's just through the car settings there. Uh, moving down, we've got your engine start stop. You've got parking plus fit to this car, which is a nice extra. Uh, so you've got front and rear sensors with the display that will come on automatically when you put the car into reverse, or you can turn it on and off uh, just by pressing the P button there. Then you've got your stability control, the button to turn the screen off and then you drive select shortcut so you can quickly scroll through your drive modes without having to go through all the main system itself. Uh, then we've got your climate control if you, you have a temperature for the driver and one for the passenger as well or your directional controls, AC and a heated rear screen. Then you've got 12 volt socket just down here, a couple of cup holders. We have an S-Tronic gearbox, so you've got a standard drive mode and a sporty setup of the gearbox. Uh, you do also have a manual mode, uh, we can use either the gear selector in manual mode as an up-down, or you can use the paddles on the steering wheel itself. You've got your volume, all the shortcuts for the infotainment system, the swivel wheel to control everything. Then we have electronic parking brake and hill hold assist. And in the centre cubby here you've got a couple of USBs um, and also an aux input there as well as a bit of storage. Uh, speaking of storage, you've got decent sized door bins, a uh, decent sized glove box which is lined with felt, so if you've got stuff in there it doesn't rattle around. Um, and then up front, in front, uh, we have a uh, nice laid out steering wheel, um, standard Audi steering wheel. Um, so you've got uh, your controls for the driver's display on the left hand section here. And then you've got your volume, track skip and hands free controls on the right hand side. Paddle shifters on the back, cruise control on a stock just down here. Rain sensing wipers, automatic lights, and heated and electrically adjustable wing mirrors as well. Uh, just moving to the back of the car, it's a five door uh, A3, so accessibility is a lot better than in the three door. Uh, it does feel like you have slightly more room as well. Uh, you've got ice fix anchor points on the outer rear seats. You've also got a 12 volt socket um, in the middle and uh, storage uh, nets behind. As I said, you can also fold down those rear seats if you need some extra storage in there as well. It's a really easy, nice car to drive. Um, 
engine's nice and peppy, so you never feel like you're lacking in power. Um, it will come with six months gold cover warranty, which can be extended for as little as £199 for an extra six months. We also have a range of finance options available, so if finance is something that you're looking for, then we can help you out with that as well. If you need any more information on this car or any of the other cars we have in stock, please go to straightens.co.uk. Thank you.